Hello YouTube, this is the DVT Air Show. Metro Prime 1, let's play Part 17, last episode. We did what, Adam? Because I can't really remember too much, apart from bitching about the PlayStation 4. We bitched about the PlayStation 4, bitched about the, uh, the, the, the guide that we're using. We also bitched about pretty much everything else. So yeah, a lot of, a lot of bitching ensued. And uh, yeah, we need to keep going past, we've gone past the safe station, we're now heading towards a circular room known as the Fendrana's Edge. Where yeah, I think I know what you're on about, hold on, I'm going to go for this pipe which hopefully will get us to where we need to go. Bingo! Fendrana's Edge, right there is a door, uh, I think it's yeah, just below you. Yeah. So, so ignore, ignore these fuckers and Run. <laughs> I have no idea what what being you need to open that, but uh, yeah, it should I be. I can't a... run. I'm sort of I'm sort of a brick right now. <laughs> no, fair enough. Let's <laughs> so, roll through another pipe, and you're into a cave into a cave known as the Hunter Cave. Yeah, I I'm getting there. And from there, you can go. Th from there, you need to go through another pipe to get the uh, next item. Ba -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> Same to you. Okay, I'm in the hunter cave now. There's three doors. Which one? Uh, it's one of the two to the f to the right hand side. Uh, right. Just just well, pick one. They both go to the same room. Let me just um, destroy these um, star tanks because I ain't got the grapple beam yet. I'm getting this. I'm getting better at this first person platforming business. Good for you. Right, you're on. That's the, that's the more direct route. Good. I don't, I don't know why, but technically they're both direct routes, but still. So, in conclusion, I will probably not be buying a PlayStation 4. It seems like my next gen console will be the Wii U. Which is somewhat ironic, because. Um. Ever since I stopped using Sega consoles, you know, my last Sega console was, was, a, was a Mega Drive, I've sort of switched to Nintendo. Didn't you have a Dreamcast? No, I didn't. Hmm. I, had a, uh, I had a Game Gear at one point. Hmm, poor sod. And, um. It, yeah, it's somewhat ironic because I've, I've had Nintendo consoles for, for quite a long time. I had an N64, GameCube, and I had a Wii. I only recently started getting other systems, like, you know, I got on PS2 off my sister, bought my own PS3, and the reason why I picked Sony because they had games that fit my ch my taste better. I never wanted an Xbox, but who knows? Can't take no news, Microsoft. Take that toll, but I might even buy yours for once. Don't be, don't be mad. So well, anyways. It could happen. <laughs> as long as you don't make it a giant de me uh, malfunctioning piece of shit as well. As long as it takes time out to actually make the damn thing properly this time, yeah. So somewhere around this mass of uh, tentacles should be... Somewhere around this mass of tentacles. Should be your next item. And there it is. I, I think you could have worded that, one, worded that one better, Adam. Well, you know what I mean. Anyway, this is the gravity suit, I believe. I also got a visor upgrade as well, if memory serves. What, in the same room? No, the gravity suit gives you a visor and upgrade so you can so you can see easier underwater. Oh, it's, it's, a ma it's not exactly a, a, a new visor, but it, it does... This improves the visor you've already got. Yeah. It's not like the X-ray visor or the, um, or the, or the um, thermal visor. It's all cool and purple and shit. I do like the gravity suit, it's one of my favourite ones. Gravity suit acquired. Really super special, extra awesome stuff. Moving to liquid. Oh, I was going to have to read that. Sorry. Anyway, yes, even I, even I can tell you can you can see a hell of a lot better now. Yeah, it's a lot less clouded, right, Adam? Where do we go next? Okay, next we have we've got the gravity suit. Next we're going to return to the gunship. Pause camera till we get back <laughs> all the way there. Oh, for the love of God! <laughs> Bloody hell! Um, I, I am not happy! 
Yeah, you got the way you got the way of being. Just look, yeah, yeah. Just get get your ass back to the Tower Nova world. Pause um, camera. Will do. Longest walk ever. About ten minutes. So yes, we're back at the Tower Nova world out, outside the gunship, and now you need to go back to that that uh, that big the big the big room. The, the, the big room. <laughs> Well, it's, it's something called the frigate crash site. It's that place you you ended up um, from the when you came back here last time. Oh, I have this serious urge to strangle the guy who wrote this this strategy guy. So, let's have a look at your. Uh, it's weird doing things. Is it really? It uh, is to, so le to left, 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 left of the left. That 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 big place, yeah. All right, we just find the bloody door. It'll be around somewhere. I've got to go higher up. You gotta get higher. You wanna get high? <laughs> you wanna get high? No. Got I've got his threat. I've got his. This guy at work was a complete obsessed with Towler. Person up with that character, he's, he's pretty weak as far as. Bit of a child. You go the wrong way, mate. Oh, I know what I can do. I can, I can jump up. I can, um. I've got an idea. I'll, I'll use the ship as a platform. <laughs> then you get sucked into it. Involuntarily save. Recharging your missiles and energy as well, though, so it's. But you just you just popped out of it. You literally just popped out of it before I press record. Whoop to your fuck nuts. There we are. You're still on the wrong side. No, I'm not. Here you are. I've got to go through this door, and there I think I'm set. Oh. See? No, to pull the camera while you figure out how to get there. No, I think it's, I think it's below me. <sighs> yes, forward, forward. Now to the right and under there. Aha! Right, we're here. Right, one more. Let me just say I'm surprised. Let me just get the hell out of these little guys. Oh. Wrong room. <laughs> Getting ahead of yourself, mate. Oh, bloody hell, you get out of here. Uh, more pull? Straight ahead, yep. There we are. Alright, let me just get the crap out of these guys. One more. These little guys. Oh, these guys. Here's Johnny! <laughs> That's a shining reference, why not? Your little missiles. So yeah, dead ahead. There's actually a missile power pin if I, be I believe you have to use the um Yeah, let's dive into the water and look for an alcove of the rocks in the centre of the lake. And, th and thankfully you can actually uh you can actually see the centre of the lake. Now you've got your gravity suit. Aha, here we go, it's on here I think. No. That's an alcove. Behind you. Aha! <laughs> Don't make me use this, because I will. Okay, you know. How much time are you surviving? We're on 8.33. Okay. Okay, so you need to keep going until you find a thing called the reactor core. No, hang on. The cargo freight lift to deck gamma. Uh, so if you find a room called that, you've, you've, got, your, you've got, got yourself an energy tank upgrade. Hold on, well, I'm uh... Just head for the white. There you go. Okay, let's go. Right, we're heading for the um, spaceship we were on in the beginning of the game now, you two. Um, it's a lot different since last time we traversed it. Well, there's not, there's not much in, it, in here, actually, um, to be honest. Most notable difference, it's been flooded. Yep. So that's why you need your gravity suit to navigate this place. Most of it is underwater. Please stop. What are you doing? Oh, I ought to go. There's a door. <laughs> My mistake. Pretty dark now. Should it? Should get a flashlight in the next game. 
Alright, let's see this maybe it's better. Possibly, yeah. Well, yeah, it does, because you can see... Uh, it does, however, make, make the, uh, the turrets blend into the background. Didn't you blow these up last time you were here? I know, shouldn't these things be evaporated by now? Right, anyway, what, what have you just activated? Yeah, one of those little power nodes thingies. It's... Opens the door behind you. I'm not sure what that is. Well, it opens the door in front of you. It's just, this gear takes a while to load because it's got all three gears on one disc. That's the problem with Metro Prime Trilogy. The load times are a little bit longer due to the fact that all three gears are on one disc. Hmm. It's a small price to pay to have more in one place, I have to say. Mm, take you away for that. Yeah, I'm not entirely sure where you are anymore. Let's so look at you. Ah, ah! Yes, I know where you are. Another two rooms in front of you. Oh, sorry. And you got a save station, and then you. And then you've got a, a morph. Not a morph ball. Uh, energy tank. Power up soon. Oh, this music's beautiful. Really nice and tranquil for killing guys with jetpacks. <laughs> this music's beautiful. All I can hear is boom, boom, Yes, the tortured death rattle of jet jet powered uh, space pirates. Yes, it's very tranquil, isn't it? I think you might need to turn off your heat visor so you can see what's what's going on. Right. So somewhere in this mass of debris. Uh, I believe we have to go through his pipe. That's a platform, mate. Well, I'm sure the pipe's somewhere. Well, possibly. I'm pretty sure I saw a, yeah, a it's power. One there you go. Hold on, Lord. That's one. Bomb. How many are there? Oh, it's four. Oh, right. So, yeah. Hold on a moment. Sorry about that. Get get back to your heat your heat vision. Where are they? Another one. Yeah, a lot of this actually involves these sort of puzzles because it is a down space station. It's got literally no power at all. Another couple over there. So if you're sick of these puzzles already, you two get used to them. Yeah, tough. There's a one. Right. Okay. We. Okay, back to, back to that door, and immediately turn right, and uh, you, you've got a uh, you, you got yourself a safe station. Uh, give me a while, do I? Appar I need to uh, traverse these platforms. Appar apparently, these rocks and metal uh, armor plating is neutrally buoyant and holds place, floats in place underwater. So yeah, it makes perfect sense, Adam. And not not if you know anything about physics, it doesn't. So, Metro Prime immediate in the face of physics. Evidently. If you go immediately right, there's a safe station. Yeah, in there. Let me just restore the power to the room. And I'm getting the safe station won't work out power. Well, of course it does. This takes a while to... Oh, fuck. Open the bloody door, there's Ram was chasing me. Yeah, guarantee that'll happen... Yeah, yes, I understand, I understand this game takes a while to load, but guaranteed it, that'll happen every time you're being chased. You've got low health, there's things chasing you, you run to the door, all I have to do is go through this one door and I'll be safe. <laughs> and the door just sits there. You think, oh my fucking Christ, <laughs> fucking open! It's actually also... I hate to um, I hate to um, say that this thing has continued into the next generation of consoles, but actually, this was on the GameCube, so it... okay, my point is still valid. Zombie, you there, there are a few moments in the game where the door you wait for the door to load, for the next area to load, and you can you can actually easily die by this, you know, with the um, zombies chasing you. Yeah, super missile. <laughs> With pleasure. Instant window maker. 
Yep, so keep going. When you get to a place called the Biohazard Containment, you've got a missile upgrade. How much time are you, sir? Actually, I'm 1453. We'll call it a day there, I think. Okay. Let's point back here, we'll call it a day. I'd also like to apologise because it is extremely dark. Well, this, is, this is an extremely dark level. I, mean, I don't know, the, the heat vision doesn't really help because that just means you can see through shit. Well, it's better than nothing. It does make things a bit brighter, but it's, it also means you can see through shit, which oh, doesn't no. really help. Uh, oh, no, I need to um, access power from the door from this side. There's, a, there's, a, there's a, some more of... Oh, great. Tentacles. That's going up upstairs, isn't it? No, we have to open the door from this side because this door will open now. I, I've been trying to shoot it and... Oh, it's locked behind you. Yeah, you have to have power to both sides of the door so you can access both ways. That's a bit dickish. Anyway, we're on about 16 minutes now, so uh, yeah, we'll see you next time, guys. Uh, Ashley, we'll, we'll show them where these nodes are, then we'll call it apart. Okay, fair enough. Because, you know, that, that would make sense. Is it supposed to be a strategy guide? Is it? You know, a Let's Play is supposed to be sort of a strategy guide, sort of game guide sort of thing. I don't know, latest episodes of my uh, Hell Yeah episode, my, my Hell Yeah uh, Let's Play seem to be just me screaming into the microphone, Yeah, you bastards! Stop killing me! No! Kind of thing. Well, um, maybe you should maybe you should stop dying then. I know, let's, let's, uh, just, just nuke the pissing thing! I am trying. It's like the last, last few episodes, it's just... I, I go and heal. And by the time I get back to where I was, I've got less health than when I went to heal. You think, for fuck's sake! Isn't there any way you can upgrade your um, health bar? If you actually watched my LP, you, you'd realise that it's upgraded to max. What about that island thing? Yes, if you actually watch my LP, you would understand it's upgraded to max. Sorry. Wait, watch, watch my pissing LP, mate. I do watch your LP. I watched every episode so far. How come you don't know it's upgraded to max? That was two episodes ago I mentioned that. I've slept since then. <sighs> what the hell? I'm pretty sure you forgot of this on my LPs as well. Possibly. What was the starter Pokemon I put on Blue LP? Uh. <laughs> I rest my case. Bulbasaur? No, it was Squirtle. Oh, that's how oh, good. <laughs> oh well. What was the What was the nickname of um of our of my of our Raichu in our Pokemon Blue LP? It's not Voltorb anymore, though, was it? No, it was it was Duracell. Duracell. All right. Okay, yes, I've forgotten shit, but that that uh, that my that's my case. Yeah, my LP is was is currently on about what. I think, I, th I think the last one I uploaded, uploaded was episode 11. That was like 100 and odd. You guys expect me to remember everything about that? There's 95 episodes, mate. Oh, bloody hell, 95. You, want, you wanted to do another one soon, aren't you? Yes. Yes. I w I'm not going to tell you which one. Well, they already know which one. We announced it. Did you? Yes. Oh. Yeah, Pokemon Silver. <laughs> we, uh... Probably do the same thing that we did last last last. Um... It's gonna be a, uh, it's gonna be a bit of a problem because. It... Will you please just do something other than just get attacked by this bloody thing? <laughs> I, I, sorry, it, it, we're on, we're on about twenty minutes. I'm stopping this. Gus, this is starting to bug me. All right, go on then. See you guys this episode. If I don't get tentacle whipped to death. See you around. <laughs>